welcome back to TNB. It's your boy, Nature Boy here. Um, excited for today. Good, good day to be today because we're doing some different type of fishing today. I'm gonna be losing live bait, some live night crawlers in bass infested waters. So I've never, <clears throat> I've never uh, used night crawler uh, in bass infested waters. Uh, strictly just fishing bass uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be different it's gonna be neat because um, it's a different type of fishing man and uh, we're gonna see what we can do hook up with some biggins and I got some juicy night crawlers on I'm putting I got some juicy night crawlers and I know it's gonna be popping <clears throat> the size of these night crawlers these fish like night crawl. I think I heard a deer. Yeah, I think that's a deer. I spooked a deer. I think he turned around. Uh, so let's get it pop. <laughs> So, two rods and some uh, ground stakes I have, and of course, the main meal of the day, 12 juicy night crawlers. I happened to go be near a pet shop, and they had some juicy, juice Canadian crawlers, baby, 12 in here, so let's get it popping today is live bait day man so i'm gonna feed these fish up what they were born to eat some good old worm so i'm using some i'll never i never fish with canadian night crawlers but this is a Canadian night crawlers. And the reason why I like choosing night crawlers is because of just sheer monster, monstrous size. It looks so delicious. Look at that. Look at the size of these things. It looks delicious to fish. And I've got a lot better hits off night crawlers than any worm I've ever tried to use. So I'm using a drop shot style just to get the um, worm down there. And I don't think I can, I'll be able to use two rods just because it's a giant night crawler and this is bass infested uh, waters. Um, and so let's get the night crawler on. Oh, this is a juicy one. This is the big one. Uh, trying to get out of my hand. Oh, I get tangled up. All right. So this is a juicy, juicy night roll. Look at this side. Look at this monstrous night roll. <clears throat> all right. Uh, usually I take it all the way in, just to and. There she is. So let's see how long this night crawler will actually last. Which I don't think it will it will last without getting hit for for a long where's my so let me throw it out. It's down. Let me just wait and see. So now I just play the waiting game. I've never really fished, like I said, in bass infested water. 
Nightcrawler. So, oh, that's the one. Fish on. Fish on. Oh, fish on. Ooh, fish on. First bass. On the oh my god, that is a huge mango. Oh my god. Now that is what you call a brim slab. Oh, that is a huge brim. These fish are probably just dang on monstrous out here. This is a huge brim. This brim is like mon I thought it was a bass. That's how that's how hard it hit. Ah, he fell. He's down. That's a bass, that's a bass, that's a bass. Oh man, that is a huge bass, nice size bass on a worm. This is what I was trying to get to. Oh, that's a big bass. This has to be two pounder. This is, this is what I'm talking about. Look at that bass, man. It's about two pound bass. Fishing for bass with live worm bass infested waters bass number one i was like man it has to be a bass it has to be a bass let this boy go i was like that had to be a bass it won't be that live bait man Some slackaroo. See what see if we can pop out something big. Something big and juicy. Come on, come on, baby. I need like a five pound on the worm. That'd be awesome. Come on, I crawl out. But it's been fairly quiet. A lot of stuff going on, I'm busting. Come on, baby. Come on, swing, bada 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 bada. Swing, bada 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 bada. It's about to be showtime. Number two, come on in, baby. Mm. It's a heavy fish, man. Jesus, oh, it's close to about. This is they're getting big now. Second big fish of the day. I didn't get the other fish on camera, but these are getting to be some big slabs. Oh, uh, bass number two caught that brim, and we are popping on this live bait, man. It's awesome. I'm using, uh, let me throw this boy back. Thanks, buddy, for playing. Well, all I'm doing is using a, um, a uh, drop shot type setup. Just putting that worm all the way through, drop shot setup, and I'm hooking it. I think I'm gonna close it out in this back cut where I was getting a lot of hits. Oh man, I just lost my dang on like cheats.
I like lost my last night crawl. Another brim. Oh, brim. Whacked it, boy. Okay, I got this one. Oh, I've never caught brim out of here, ever. And these brim feisty. I'll try to hold it well. These, these guys are very aggressive, brim. Oh, he's aggressive. Nice color brim. These are like kind of spotted brim. You can tell. Very, very cool. Let him go. Feisty. That was a feisty. But I don't think I could have hold that fish. <clears throat> All right, fishing freaks. That concludes today's fishing. Fishing was so good. Uh, that one fish I didn't get on camera. Wish I could have got that fish on camera. But uh, I believe I caught like uh, three. Three three bass and two brim. That one brim, that brim was humongous, man. And I've never caught a, I've never caught a brim out of this creek. I mean, I've seen them uh, spawn. They spawn. Uh, I've seen them spawn the legs, stuff like that. I've seen it spawn like probably like thirty of them spawn, but never caught a brim out of here. Never caught you know purposely purpose. Okay, I've never caught a large mouth bass. Never caught a large amount of bass on a uh, live bait, especially like a night crawler. I would, probably would never have thought about that, but you you never know. You try different things. So today was well. Really smashed it on the night crawl. I'm do have to do this again, and this is one of my honey holes. So I mean these these bass like night crawlers. So uh, great episode today. Thank you guys for joining me uh, here at TNB. I will catch you next time. And remember, keep it popping.